Hello everybody and welcome back to the Mega Modded Dead Cod Plus series. We're jumping in again and we finally reached a streak of 10 doing pretty well. As you can see, I'm recording in the same session. So we've got 10 exact there, but we'll randomize once more. I don't know why sometimes the randomizer just doesn't work. We've got Tainted Job. Tainted Job is quite the spicy one with a lot of unlocks. I'm happy to be playing him. I think we have played him once before on this, uh, on this series. I can't actually remember, but we can take a pretty quick check just by pressing tab here. We have, we went and did the beast as this guy last time. So we'll try and avoid the beast this time. And great, great item to start. We get both. Are you kidding me? I doubt, I very highly doubt we'll get enough charges to somehow grab that we do have to be careful by the way because this character can die really really easily like he has such low starting hp he has judas levels of starting hp so we gotta be very careful but we do start out with a bit of extra damage and stuff so a bomb there would be really nice but yeah starting out with proptos is amazing i'd love to dare's custodia um the other item in there can't remember what it's called now because it's a very good item but if we lose it we lose it it's it is what it is sort of thing isn't it Okay, let's just be very careful as to not get hit by a champion here. So, Jacob and Izao is unfortunately not really something we can use. Let's fight the boss. And, oh god, we could easily die here. What on earth is this? What on earth is this? See, I don't really know the best way to play this out. I'm trying to kill the fetuses first. Didn't end up working out. Okay, that wasn't so bad. That's a very unique version of this boss. Very unique indeed. Okay, so honestly, just grab both of these. Um, or, or we can grab both anyways. I keep forgetting that as this character. Okay, so we're unfortunately probably going to lose Deadeye. Um, at least at some point. Uh, maybe not now, but some point in the future. But I will still... Um, I'll still check the shop and stuff. Unfortunately, nothing there. We are, of course, still playing with the new mod. Um, I have requested to the developer if there's um, a pot potential of an option to tweak the amount of floppy disks that spawn. Whoa. My, I, I picked up Deadeye and my FPS is just like, like absolutely tanked. What on earth? Like my FPS is like so much lower right now. What the hell? I've actually not got the um, in-game display on. I think it's Shift-Tab. Let me have a little look-see. Um, in-game, display FPS, top left corner. Just so I can kind of see what we're running at. 43 at the minute. I don't know why that's just happened. Okay, let's fill that up real quick. I don't know why specifically Deadeye did that. That's, that's, that's very strange. Maybe it's something to do with the way Deadeye interacts with the Proptosis, but we'll see. We'll probably end up losing it here anyways. We lost Stye, that's not too bad. Oh, we did lose Deadeye. Okay, so yeah, my FPS is back to um, back to 55 now. I don't know what, what the hell that was about, but it did not like me having Deadeye. I will play this. I realize I don't have a lot of money right now, but I thought I'd gamble. So yeah, I thought we'd end up losing Deadeye. We also lost Stye as well, so we ended up keeping the least valuable item of the ones that we had, which is a bit of a shame. But I shall accept it for what it is. Right. That can take up to another two coins, so we should hopefully get that this floor. In fact, we could pit, maybe even get it this room if we're lucky enough. Let's try it out. Okay, there's one penny. Proptosis. Oh, there you go. Is very good for us here. Right, let's have a little look-see. And crack that bad boy open. I'll even use this pill as well, actually. 48 RNG is actually fantastic. Because that means if there's good items, we can Deus Custodia them both. Unlike the last floor, we had to, unfortunately, get rid of Deadeye. But then again, Deadeye ended up causing us a bunch of lag. And I have no idea why. So, <laughs> I guess it's maybe for the best. Right, let's crack this open. Both of these are very, very good. I'm going to Deus Custodia them both. Both of these are incredible. Of course, massive fire rate boost for purity. Jelly Belly giving us a 50% chance to negate damage is pretty incredible. It's a lot of Deus Custodia in early, but this is three very, very good items that I very much want to keep. By the way, for the question of the day today, it's just going to be a basic one. It's going to be a simple one. I've asked it before, but I'm going to ask it again. What was the last game you played and why? I feel like some repeat questions... Like, what, what did you last eat and things like that? They're going to come up time, uh, a few times here and there. Especially when I record multiple episodes in a day and I don't have as much to go on. 
but it's interesting to find out. Unfortunately, that did um, re-roll our... Uh, it did re-roll our... What's it called? Um, purity Aura by Deus Custodia in there. Apparently, that counts as getting hit. Didn't think it would, but apparently it does. If you have Petrified Poop, that'll help out along the way here. I don't really want to go anything over, like, five Broken Hearts. I think, honestly, the items that we've set ourselves up with right now, we're pretty happy to stick with. I wouldn't be too remiss if we ended up keeping these ones on. Okay, careful, careful. There you go. Right, I don't want to use my Magus there. I've got that for the extra batteries just in case I need it. Oh, the damage. People that say Proptosis is bad now are actually idiots. It's so good. Uh, double speed ups here. I don't really care about keeping either of those. I will check my Devil Deal just in case. I'm actually not that interested in either of those, to be honest. Gimpy is pretty good, but I don't think it's worth uh, Deus Custodian. So let's see what we lose. In fact, I think we have to lose our speed upgrades, right? No, we, we, we only lost one item there. Okay, we have insane speed right now. We've uh, maxed out our speed completely. Very, very nice. But... Hey, we got this trinket again that replaces rocks with poop. I think I'm probably better off with uh, petrified poop right now, though, to be honest. So, yeah, it, it does look like our purity aura is going to get re-rolled. Pretty much every single um, every single floor because of Deus Custodia, whether we get hit or not, which is a bit of a shame. Because we could end up getting like damage or fire rate and um, not wanting to lose it. But then again, vice versa, we could have a bad aura and get a good one. So maybe it's not a terrible idea. Yeah, all you gotta do with Proptosis is just stay nice and close. Stay nice and close and you deal tons of damage. Look at that. Three times damage just for standing next to him. And this is a boss that it's really easy to stand next to. For the most part. Without getting hit. There you go. Absolutely easy breezy. So, Perfection's rather nice. I'll take that. These two are another two that I'm fine to just leave as is. I will check my Devil Deal here. There isn't either of them that I want to keep. I will take Starvation though. Starvation can be pretty good. Did lower our damage a little bit, but give us a good amount of fire rate. And I'll take that as well, the Fettered Heart. I, again, I don't really mind losing that. Now we have a lot of, um... A lot of Burn Hearts now, which is, isn't a bad thing. I quite like having Burn Hearts. We've managed to keep our, um... What's it called? Alive as well, our Rotten Heart, which is rather nice for this setup. Ooh, uh, the rooms are split into sections here. We've got to be a little careful. Got a first floppy disk, um... Ooh, okay, let's just use it. Corrupted Wabbit. Uh, spawns two to three copies of Corrupt Wabbit has a small chance to turn all copies into Super Troll Bombs. Oh, God. Um, okay. I don't really see what the, what's the point in having multiple the same one here. Uh, Nod Leaf there with an interesting resprite. I mean, I don't really care about that as an active, but I'll take it. Nod Leaf is whatever. All of these I'm not going to bother keeping around. I don't think we really need to. Good, good. Another floppy disk. Someone's several friendly champions. Okay, uh, it could be corrupted. And he, uh, in, indeed it wasn't, so we got a, a good version of that this time. Lookup's rather nice there, thank you. And we'll beeline it away. We can go and check our shop out if we want. We don't have a ton of money to play around with, so there's not too much point. Having these guys as champions is really nice. Pheromones. Yeah, these, uh, these worm dudes as champions is pretty good. I will check it out, actually. Um, I'll at least buy the soul heart. Quick, quick, the speed is so crazy. We are moving at the speed of sound right now. It's, ins it's insane. Okay, let's check this out as well. Eh, nothing there that I really need. Hey, whoa, that's an interesting looking envy. Oh, that's a, that's an eternal envy, isn't it? That's an eternal envy. Whoa, he merged. What the hell, he merged? What happened? This is confusing. Okay, so we're having some really strange... Oh my god. We're having some really strange issues with Eternal Champions and Unique sin Sins. I might have to turn off Unique Sins for a little bit while we're using Eternal Champions. Because it's well confusing. <laughs> it's very, very strange. Okay, another floppy disk. Freeze half the room. I'm okay with that one, fine. Thank you. I'd rather keep my Magus. 
The Magus with our current setup is so good. One thing we have to be very careful of though is whenever we use our Magus, we have to make sure that the bottle of pills is full charge. Otherwise, it'll charge that instead. And that would be an absolute travesty. That would be a complete waste. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Oh, I forgot it has to take some items first. Lost a bit of speed there. Lost our Salsa. Lost our uh, Consolation Prize. We did get our range up, which is kind of nice. Oh, look at that. The, yeah, these champion worms are absolutely going in. Oh, what the hell? No! Champion worm! I can't believe you'd do this to me. <laughs> Lost perfection because it blocked the... Ah, oh, that was evil. So it doesn't matter. Both the champion worms are now dead. And <laughs> I was just praising you. I was just praising you. How could you do this to me? I can't believe it. Such savagery. We lost our Rotten Heart as well. How sad. None of that went the way I wanted it to. At least we've got a bit of money now, though. We can play around with the shot. We've always been a little bit short so far. But yeah, I do love this character. For those of you that haven't played him before, he is a pretty complicated character. I wouldn't say super complicated, but essentially um, every floor we're going to be losing a portion of the items we picked up. But as you can see, every floor we get doubled the amount of items. And then if we use our Deus Custodia, our pocket active, the 12th room charge item, it will let us keep an item forever. It'll never get taken off of us, but we will gain a broke broken heart for doing so. So there's a lot of risk reward with this character, but you tend to have... Uh, it's kind of like with Tainted Eden where, you're, where your build varies quite often uh, because your items are changing out so much. But you, you're kind of like Tainted Isaac in a way as well where you have like a base level of items that are always going to stick with you. It's pretty cool. Right. So I think Quad Shot is a, is a must grab for Deus Custodia. And I don't really care about the Hive. Quad Shot with the Fire right here as well. Beautiful. Oh my god. The damage, baby. We got a double tinted rock here. I see you, I see you. Probably small rock here for us. Doubled the items. Okay, so I think I think I'm actually gonna keep small rock just for a guaranteed stat upgrade. So let's grab small rock and keep that. And we'll just grab that as is. And I'm okay to pop that now. Chill pill. The new pill. Okay, so we're getting onto the onto the radius of having um having quite a lot of broken hearts now i really only ever want to take one more broken heart than this but i think we've set ourselves up with a good amount of stats and stuff crack that open fake door okay probably should pick up the full card actually i don't know why i didn't easy bangers on these dudes yeah the quad shot here with the current fire rate we've got going on is is really good did you see me accidentally knock that shot away then? That was completely accidental, but also perfect. These two we can just grab. And we got... Spawns a traveling salesman. We'll, we'll uh, have a look at the traveling salesman. Spawns six glitch pickups. Oh, wow. Let's just grab them all and see what we get. King of diamonds. Didn't do anything. I, was, I didn't read what it did first, to be honest. That's my fault. Infested. And then we also got this as well. All enemies in the room get sucked into a loop, repeating their last few actions over and over. Isaac gets stuck in a loop, but instead his HP is reset at the start of each loop. Interesting. And then we got a Joker card as well, which is pretty good. Restock isn't really our jam right now. Anything here we want? Um, Judas' Shadow is kind of nice, but... I don't think we really need either of those. Okay. Let's, uh, let's just head on our way. We've got a Joker card if we want to use that on the next floor wherever we don't end up getting a deal. Especially if we've got Deus Custodia ready. I think it's going to be a bit more important. So we're going to lose um, Starvation there, which is actually not great because that's put our fire rate down to, I wouldn't say low levels, but a lot lower than it was before. So now we kind of need um, our fire rate purity aura, which I'm going to try and get. We got Damage Aura this time, though. I'm pretty happy with Damage Aura, considering our damage is, like, okay, but not crazy. Okay, good, good. Things are going well so far. Honestly, just the Proptosis pickup. It's too good. People, 
I don't know. I, I, honestly, I don't actually know when saying this how many people actually believe this, but there was a time when Repentance first got updated that a lot of people were really down on Proptosis and thought that it got like some sort of huge nerf. And it's like, it did get nerfed in a way, but it also got massively buffed as well. Like, oh God, the nerf to buff ratio is like pretty good. Okay, got damage aura back that time. These flies are a bit janky. Okay. Good, good, good. Thought I'd check those just in case. Ah! Oh, oh, God damn it, I tried. I don't have the speed for that. To be fair, I'm fine because I'm, I'm, I'm trying to reroll my aura anyways. I'm, I really need fire rate aura, which to be honest is kind of pointless for me to do because it's only going to get taken away, away from me next floor anyways. It's not like I can keep it for a significant amount of time. But I still would like it. Probably just be better sticking off with, with uh, whatever good one we end up getting. Yeah. I will check these out just in case we get like a good item from them or something. Or a soul heart that I can grab. Ooh, this guy's gonna hit, hurt me quite a bit. Yep. Okay, we got him. Ooh, quite a cheeky little boss there. That'd be no luck pennies though. Big sad. Another floppy disk. Random tech item, we don't need that really. The floppy disks are pretty good, but they're pretty situational. I mean, they are just like cards and pills where you're not going to use them all the time. I just wish at the minute they were a little less common than they currently are, because I'm finding a hell of a lot of them. Nice. Oh, soul heart? No. Sadly not. I'd like it if the purple fires had a little bit higher chance to drop soul hearts than the red ones. Uh, than the red ones and the blue ones, even. Oh, for God's sake. Oh, we, we uh, bashed him away with uh, Jelly Bean there. Jelly Belly. We still not have seen that item yet, actually. Quickly go and check that out. But yes, things are going pretty, pretty well for us so far. Pretty, pretty well. I think this room's got, got the goods. We got fire rate right here as well. Damn, you losing starvation there was pretty bad. Brown Nugget... <sighs> Both of these aren't good. I'm going to take Brown Nugget over that, though. Okay, Crawl Space. Here we are. Wow. What a what a selection. Isaac's Heart and Marked. Um, you know me. I will take both. I'm not going to Days Custodia either of them, but I'm taking both. That didn't increase my fire rate at all, which I'm very upset about. I really thought it would, but it did increase my range a good amount. It would be nice to get some shot speed up as well, though. Shot speed is really the main stat you want with Proptosis to make it pop. That was a uh, that was a room that not many people would take either item from, but I'm uh, I'm in it. I'm in it to win it. By in it to win it, I mean I'm going to take items that might kill me. Ooh. Interesting to see that my uh, Isaac's heart automatically charges with marked here. We got you, you eternal big boy. We got ourselves a shop. We got meat. We got shot speed, which I was just saying is pretty good for us here. Um, we got an emperor card. We don't really want that. We'll take the uh, the devil, the Joker card here actually. And I will take that, and I'll dare custodia it. It's another decent damage up. And then I guess I'll just grab this for the next floor. Okay, so we're kind of at our broken heart limit now, unless we find like a confessional or something. We'll see how this goes. Uh, we lose meat, and we lose Nord Leaf, and that's it. Okay, that's not too bad. Ooh, is this, is this a choice or do we get both? Because I want both, although I probably should try and keep at least one of them. Crown of Light and Jacob's Ladder are both really good. I should try and at least keep... Um, Jacob's Ladder, right? Which means we need to do quite a lot more charging up. Oh, we should go to our cash room, by the way. They're, they're free for us right now. I didn't even think about that.
Also, that's free for us too. Beautiful. Hey! Heart, stop. <laughs> stop being so rude. I am uh, in like kind of curious that the heart auto charges there. I didn't think it would. Um, well, the battery beggar is kind of a must play if we can. Because I, I, I want charges here. But he is very, very awkward to play. Wait, no, no, he's not. I was like, he's very awkward to play. It doesn't matter. It makes no difference to us whatsoever. You paid out straight away, you little dick. When do you when do they then them dudes ever pay out straight away? Never. We got sharp plug though, which means we can get it if we want to. Having the heart auto charge is so good actually. Oh, planetarium. That's interesting. Okay, so now I'm kind of curious what to use this on. Do you know, this is this is going... Okay, with Mark, this thing's awful. I regret. What the hell's still alive? God damn it. Wasted all of that. We got Mars and Soul. I actually don't care about either of those particularly, so I'm just going to grab them both. Like, I, I, do, I do like them, but neither of them are like... Must grab sort of thing. Ow. Don't know what I don't know what we got going on here. Plastic bag and cat food. Okay. I don't know what, I don't know what mass producer does, but I'll take it. Don't know what type of hand we've got coming down here, but I'm scared. Oh, it's an eternal one of these. Oh god. Okay, I think it just drops a lot more spiders. I'm getting hit a lot right now. But we got our fire rate bonus again, good. Fire rate bonus is back. Quickly check this out. Is that car battery there? I don't think it is, right? That's not car battery. Okay. So let's quickly go back and it's this is this is the hard question. Do I grab Crown of Light as my thingy item? Or the Electric Tears? I think Electric Tears, right? And that's likely to be better. Both are good. You've got a lot of health, sir. You're quite chunky. Ooh, an actual eternal enemy and boss. Wow. Oh, okay, so this room is fulfilling its purpose now. This room is doing what it's supposed to do. These guys are tough. Okay. Keep it going. And then I think, I think Deus Custodia is now out of commission. I don't think we can use it for the rest of the run. Which I think is fine. I think we've got good stuff going on right now. I don't think we're likely to want to use it. Oop, card there. Nice. Just a lovers. I will take that though because we are rocking red health right now. Beautiful. Fettered Heart's doing real nice. I guarantee I lose Fettered Heart. I'm going to lose, like, Isaac's Heart next, or Fettered Heart, or even Marked. Something that's actually going to have, like, a, a pretty big impact on the run and make it worse. Unfortunately, I lost my, uh, my extra damage there. This is... Is this Red Mum? She is taking quite the beating. I lost my Burn Heart, unfortunately, which is not good. Yeah. Let's quickly pop in here first. Nothing I really want. Grab that. And that. We will check out Boss Rush here. There's some good stuff in here. There's some good stuff in here. So we got empty LG spot. Someone's a statue of your character attracting enemies to it. We got technology, which is pretty good. I'll take technology. And we'll take that as well. 
Ow, that hit me? Why? It might actually be better to take Brown Nugget, you know. I don't know. Although, technology is kind of slapping. Okay, yeah, technology's slapping real hard. Oh my god. Also, having the uh, ability to drag enemies into one focal point is going to help. And it seems to last through two waves sometimes, too. Oh, and we got Mars to dash around as well. This is going swimmingly. Okay, some enemies are going to be eternal, apparently. That's fine. That's a lot of hearts in that little circle there. Is that an eternal angel? Is Okay, wait. Wait, 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 wait. Are they all going to be eternal from now on? Because that seems like that's what the case is going to be. I mean, I'm not super displeased about that. But that's a champion. Bumbino there. Where's the other uh, thing? Oh, there you are. Some mini Isaacs in the in the, his house. Yeah, they're all eternal now. Like all of them that can be are. Why are you just jumping constantly, sir? Calm yourself. Lots of little heart boys. Oh my god. The black hole is working so well. Oh my god, it's working way too well. Why is there so many hearts? This is obscene. There's so many bombs as well. <laughs> Eternal champion boss rush. No problem. I like the way I do literally like no damage unless I'm close. Stop Mars dashing the wrong direction, you fool. Oh my god. What the hell's this over here? It belongs in a museum. Reap Creep there. Reap Creep did get dragged over for a second. Okay, Reap Creep, I've got to get closer to you. This swarm of hearts is just causing the game to kind of shit itself. It really doesn't like it. I... I wish I'd Dace Custodian Technology now. I'm just going to take both of these, though. I can't afford more HP loss. I will take this, though. Right. Let's go. <laughs> that got pretty wild. That got pretty wild. But we got our way through it. Okay, that's a darkness. What are you stealing from me? Gossamer bag. Wooden spoon. Cat food. Black bean. Isaac's heart. Okay. Almost everything it took there was pretty okay. I'm a little sad about Isaac's heart. I would have liked to have keep kept that. I was enjoying having it. But everything else is pretty okay in my books. This setup's really good. Because the thing is, like, Hemolacry, it, it is not Hemolacry, sorry, Lacrophagy. It is lowering our range technically, but I don't actually care because we don't have much range anyways. Another two floppy disks there. Yeah, I'll leave those. My lord. Good. We're blitzing through the rooms as well. Jacob's ladder's really helping out. Ooh, what the hell was that? Ah, piss bed. I don't want piss bed. I'm fine, thank you. I keep forgetting as well, like, right now we've got double damage. This is such a cool build. 
Absolute zappy zappies. Matriarch here. I think Matriarch is a prime candidate for the black hole. Yep, prime candidate. Black hole wrecked you. Some HP up, which doesn't really matter. And Mum's Pearls. Probably shouldn't have taken that Rotten Heart thinking about that, but oh well. I think we still got a Lover's card right, just in case. We do, good. I'm definitely going to need that at some point. So now we lose Mars, which is fine. We literally only lost Mars. That's actually preferable to me. Don't know how I got hit in that room, but we had the Lovers to save ourselves from the anguish. God, this is this is brilliant. This feels like a proper like crazy technology run. I feel technologically advanced. So many chess varieties now, it's crazy. <laughs> There's just so many different types we've got installed. Dude, don't be like this. Let's get oh. Who made this enemy? Get them on the phone. Come on, my little fellas. Right, let's keep pushing forward. I don't know what uh, what item that was back there. What the hell is that? Bismuth duplicates all shots fired. Shots fire in random arcs that change every few seconds. That sounds like a lot of fun. I'm going to go and grab a penny real quick and come back and buy that because that sounds just like a lot of fun. <laughs> it's a quality zero, which makes me a little scared. But I did see that on the mod page, someone did say there's a bug where every item appears as quality zero. So it might just be a visual bug. You know what? This is fine by me. This works exactly as I'd like it to. Seems really good with this technology setup with Marked as well. Honestly, it's it's just zapping. It like it's creating so many arcs from Jacob's Ladder. Or what's whatever it's called. Is it Jacob's Ladder? Yeah, Jacob's Ladder, right? I'm getting confused. I'm confusing myself. Look at that. Yes. My arc lightning will stop all living life everywhere. I think we should be okay on the light, the amount of health we've got left as well. I do have to be a little careful of certain enemies. I've got to be careful to not get hit, but... Especially on bosses, Black Hole does a very good job of making sure we don't get hit. There you go. This is a cool item. I like it. The sprite for it's really good too. Up we go. We should have done Hush really, but honestly, without some healing, without like a Lover's card going into it, I'm not super confident on that, so... And um, we're going to lose... Oh, we lost that space bar item. Like, not that that's a massive tragedy, but that was the thing that was saving us directly in boss fights. It's a little, it's a little hard to, to, to lose that and be okay with it. This is just nuts. And with the, the Fettered Heart as well still being around. I didn't the Fettered Heart would stay around so long, but it hasn't. It's done a very good job. Oh God. Unfortunately, Mr. Footman is doing his foot thing. It's okay though, we've just about killed him. There you go, got him. Don't like you, footman. Okay, so Isaac, luckily not eternal, so we shouldn't have too bad of a time with this that, this dude. Just remember, the closer we are to him, the more damage we're going to deal. So we would preferably be up in his face. I'm not going to, like, clear that too close to the, uh, to the line there. I don't want to die. If I can get away with it, like this, I did get hit once there. We got, we got a sun card and we kill it anyway, so it doesn't matter if I got hit anyways. We have exactly four keys as well, which is perfect. 
Let's see what the chest gives us. What do you got for me? Oh shit, lots of items that I can't see. So holy water is obvious. It's lost soul, I think. S steroids. Bot Botfly. Fruit cake. Oh, Falgus. Oh no, that's bad. Um, Cursed dice is pretty bad for us. Empty heart is whatever. And rainbow baby. Okay, so foul goat's pretty bad. We're gonna need some red hearts, pretty stat. Just because we're gonna die in half the amount of hits. But we'll, we'll, we'll see how this goes. I guess. I guess at the minute we just gotta hope for the best. My lost soul died. Who cares? Is what? Is that Doc's defeat us there? I feel like that could be a tragedy. Let's be very careful with that. I really should not have taken a Dark Bomb there either, because that's going to just steal my hearts away. Definitely taking some damage in this room. I feel it. Oh, wait, no. Are we okay? Are we okay? Okay, we're okay. That was surprising to me. An Eternal Heart will actually give us some more free hits. So I would like to take that. We did get some cards and stuff in here. Nice. The Moon. Pretty nice. And we get Flip. And bird's eye. Unfortunately, flip doesn't do much for us really here. That is the paddle. Interesting. And gold flakes. Turns our weird trinket into gold. Don't know what our weird trinket does, but we have it. We do indeed have it. Oh god, I am still a little scared here. We got ourselves bomb bag and whatever the hell this is. The game kid. Okay, game kid's a great pickup. I'm taking game kid. That is gonna save us. Blue baby spawns flies. Game kid gives, invin gives us invincibility and the ability to eat enemies for HP. I think this is gonna be exactly what we need. Oh baby, you. You're all that I need. You know I'm just a friend. Oh god. We just lost two hearts. Oh lord. Luda, didn't mean to pick that up. Okay, that could be great or terrible. I do not know how this is going to go. We also got little Steven. Okay, this is terrible. This is legitimately terrible. It's doing like no damage. Oh, no, 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 okay. It does, it does damage, we just got to sit it on top. Okay, we can utilize Game Kid to stay really close to him. Ooh, the paddle is knocking back shots. Okay, we're all out. Just circle him closely. Try and keep the laser on him. Ooh, he tried to trick me. Holy water there, doing some good. Yeah, Luda wasn't a great pickup here. I mean, it's not been terrible, but... I think we would have had more damage otherwise. I think we're fine now, though. We're keeping him, like, relatively stunned. He would have killed us in two hits, though. Very scary. But we got it. Oh, I mean... We'd lose the streak if we go to the void. We would. But it is worth it. Let's try it. Please take Ludo away from me. Crown of Light's gone. Fettered Heart's gone. Okay, it took a lot of good from us and left us with Ludo, which um, physically can't deal damage in this room. I physically can't deal damage. Okay, they got. I got him. I got him. You need to stay somewhat centered, otherwise, like, li this is so stupid. I literally can't hit him unless he's in certain positions. <laughs> I would like to remove Ludo from my deck, please. It's ruined everything. Mm. 
Ludo has ruined everything I loved. Ooh. Ooh. That's pretty good. Ow. Took some damage there. We can't lose anything more either here, so that's good. Yeah, the Ludo ring needs to be smaller. It's too big right now. Okay, just go for the bosses. It wasn't Delirium, I'm grateful for that. Nice. I think honestly we could get a lot of items out of this and a lot of good ones too. So this might end up working out for us if we can avoid delirium for a little bit. <laughs> so annoying when I literally can't hit the enemy though. How did I not get hit then? Okay, it doesn't matter. I got hit. This can't be delirium, I don't think. Yeah, look how much slower we're killing like... This dude, we'd have been killing so much faster if we had our, our old setup. Luda, why gotta be this way? This is still good damage, but come on now. We all know you ain't Luda. Um, you are Luda, even. When we stand really close, it does a good amount. But with Delirium, we're not gonna be standing very close. We did just get Beelzebub, which is rather nice. Shot speed down isn't great. I don't think there's any way that we can remove Ludo either on purpose. I think we're just kind of stuck with it. Oh, these guys are charmed. Thank God. That's really nice. Okay, having these guys charmed is actually pretty good. They, they seem strong. I'm kind of hoping for a better active. This one is good, but it's not really going to do much. Like, it's going to help us stay close to him for a little bit, but it won't be nearly enough for the whole fight. Okay, I didn't even get to see what your attacks were. But that's fine by me. As long as you're out of my life. Out of my life. Got another boss room that's revealed over here for some reason. I'm not sure, I'm not quite sure why. Okay, I, by some miracle, didn't get hit there. Oh my god, it's a tiny little... It's a tiny big worm. Wait. Okay, I think we're screwed. <laughs> I have to kill these guys with orbitals. Okay. <laughs> wow. It's so funny that I can be screwed that hard. Okay, we do have fire rate on our aura at the minute as well, which is really nice. Carry on. Is, is that boss that's revealed delirium? It's very possible that it is. Let's go check the rooms above first then, because there's still a few more above. There's one path I didn't take. One thing that is really annoying, I will say, is Jacob's Ladder constantly making noise. I'm sure none of you are liking that. Here's what it is, though. Do we even need Fire Rare with this setup? I don't even know. I feel like maybe no, but also possibly yes. Okay. Not Delirium, good. I think that, that other boss that's revealed is Delirium. Hey, just jumping down and making flies for me, thank you. That's pretty good. Refunds, familiar upgrades when using sewing machines? Nah, that's fine, whatever. In fact, I don't think any of these are worth it. In fact, I will take that though. Okay. 
Alexa, baby. Thank you. More damage. We also got Conjoined, which I don't think does anything. God damn. Why well, you gotta go and ruin everything, uh, Luda? We'd have had so many cool synergies right now. But Luda, you just gotta be a dick, don't you? Normally Luda is really good for synergies as well, but we're just cannibalized by the Tech X one. It's not even Tech X, it's just technology. Ow. Should not have been hit there, but it used our card. Oh god. This is a room where we can't hit the corners again. Okay, we can we can just about hit them actually. Just about. Uh removes corruption from all floppies. Floppies can only be corrupted, spawns a floppy disk. Someone's several champions. Nice. Seems pretty good. We need an extra heart to get into the fight first, though. My god, a lot of champion boys here. So that's Delirium right there, right? No, it, it can't be. That's not enough space for Delirium. Let's just find out. No, it's not. I don't know why that, that this boss fight was already revealed then. We got whatever this is. What the hell's that? It vibrates patiently. Do you not know? Okay, check this room here. It's a lot of card packs. Um, uncorrupts, uncorrupted items in the room get stuck in a loop. On two to three floppy disks. Why do I keep getting Wabbit back again? This creates a wall of fire. Okay, we don't really need any of them. Just as worth, worth popping just now. And what was the other card we had here? Huge growth is actually really, really good. We'll take huge growth. This is delirium. Pop huge growth. So this is going to be probably kind of a long fight. Because I, I just can't stay near him with prop to I need to. And as you can see, it's really hard to chase him around because... My shot speed is fairly low. Oh, well, I wouldn't say it's fairly low, but it's not amazing. What we can do is pop our space bar when he changes into his regular delirium form to stay close to him. But only when he does that. Otherwise, I'm not going to change. Did you just kill my friends? If he turns into Eternal Champion Monstro, then back into regular Delirium Monstro just then. That was confusing. I think he did. Okay, there's Isaac. Oh, God. If we don't get hit here, it's a miracle. My goodness. Adversary. How could you? Okay, we've still got three hits left. We're doing pretty well so far. Oh, my goodness. We're almost ready to just pop a, a space bar. Honestly, let's just pop it. Oh, wait, no. That didn't work. Okay, I still have damage to him anyways, but it wouldn't let me move Ludo. Ludo. I thought it would. Either way, that went really well. We, we got a few unlocks there for this guy. Very, very nice. Job's Leper Flesh unlocked. There you go. Good few unlocks for this guy. I hope you guys did enjoy this one, and I will see you guys in the next one.